617. In today's Money Watch, some Americans are buying post office merchandise to financially support it. And pepperoni is the latest pandemic shortage. Hate to hear that. Jane King live in New York with the Monday Morning Business Report. Good morning. <laughs> Margaret, we had a pepperoni pizza this weekend. How crazy that this story would pop up. So yes, there's a shortage of pepperonis according to Bloomberg. This is mainly impacting the small pizzerias. Now pepperoni's price has gone up about 50% through the virus. Pork processors are still short on workers and demand for pizza, especially pizza delivery has soared. While the USPS website had a flash sale over the weekend, with an offer of 50% off select retail items. Many of the products sold out. There's a lot of people who were trying to financially support the post office. Now the website had a, a wide range of things. There were sweatshirts and t-shirts and costumes and tote bags, toy trucks as well. The post office though, billions in debt. It recently lost more than two billion as business and first class mail drop. And Walmart will stay open later at most of its stores in the US, joining other large chains that have started to stay open longer than they did during the early days of the pandemic. So the retailer has extended some stores closing time from 8.30 to 10 p.m. And a Walmart spokesperson said the additional hours do allow customers time to spread out their shopping. Well, stocks finished Friday mostly flat. We did get some new numbers that show American shopping is back to pre-pandemic levels. Uh, this morning, though, very quiet. The Dow's pointing to a four-point gain. So pretty slow going so far this morning. Live in New York, I'm Jane King. Back to you, Margaret Ann. It is just, it's always the littlest things that you don't realize could become a shortage, Jane. That's actually like know. Least. Oh, it's, it's uh, the economic impact of this, nobody could have predicted. It's been absolutely fascinating. It really has. Very bizarre. All right. Thanks so much, Jane. We'll see you tomorrow morning.